Claude, I just want to ask you a question regarding cover letters and resumes. I know that these days people apply online, applicant tracking system. If they don't have those keywords, their resumes will be not be will be in the pipe. So what tips you have for job seekers how to stand up in their cover letters or in their resumes? Yeah. So I do think it's a it's an interesting time now because things are so they're just all digital. However, I can tell you what I'd like to see. Every now and then, I really enjoy a personalized note. Someone finds my email or they find me on LinkedIn and they send me a note letting me know that they've already uh, sent in their resume through the applicant tracking system. But they send me a note which just says why they feel like they would be a good fit. Or, you know, I know you might not see this email, you might not see this LinkedIn uh, message. But if you do, I want you to know these are my values, those types of things. So you have to be very creative these days. Yes. That is the truth. And the more personalized you can get without being uh, eerie and weird, <laughs> the better that is. So, for example, if a stranger asked me something about my daughter, I wouldn't like that. That's too, too close for comfort. But if you know that I like snowboarding and, you, and, it's, and it's winter time, you can ask me, have I gone snowboarding this, this winter? You know, personalize it to an extent. Just don't cross the boundaries. Yeah. Thank you for that tip, Claude. And for the audience watching, if you have any other tips in terms of cover letter or resumes, again, please leave it in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel and tune in tomorrow for other questions with Claude.